love this tune. One, two, three, four. <laughs> Hey fiddlers, welcome to today's fiddle lesson video. Today we're going to be playing a tune called The Sailor's Wife, one of a great many aquatic fiddle tunes. I'll be teaching you the tune and a variation on the tune, so stay tuned. Alright, let's go ahead and learn the tune. First of all, it can be very helpful to know the key we're in so that we know where these left hand fingers are going to go. I think of this tune as being in the key of D Dorian. Some people might think of it as being in the key of D minor. They're pretty similar, just one note difference. Let's play a D Dorian scale. Starts with your open D. One, low two, three, A. One, low two, three. We're also gonna have some notes on the E string, so let's play those as well. We're gonna play your open E, low one, low two, which is a whole step away, and three. We've got our key signature, let's figure out our time signature. This is a jig, so we are in 6-8 time, one of my favorite time signatures. So we've got that 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 feel to our tune. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. So we've got our key signature and our time signature. We are ready to dive in and learn this tune. As with many fiddle tunes, this tune has an A part, which is the first half of the tune, and a B part, which is the second half of the tune. So let's start with the A part. I'll be teaching this tune by call and response, so you can learn it by ear. And I'll be teaching it in short phrases. I'll play that phrase, and I'll play it a few times. You can pause the video, try playing it back, and then listen again and correct anywhere you might have gone a little bit astray. Here is the first phrase of the A part. It starts with your open D and it'll go like this. One, two, three, four. So the finger numbers for that part are D, one, low two, one, One more time. The next part starts with your third finger on the E string, and it'll go like this. One, two, three, four. So basically you're doing a downward scale starting with that third finger. It'll go three, low two, low one, E, three, low two, then A, one, low two, A, three, one, three. The next part of the tune is exactly the same as the first part, but let's play it again. Starts with that open D, one, two, three, four. Finger numbers, D, one, low two, one, D, A, three, E, low one, low two. And the last 
phrase of the A part starts with that third finger on the E string, and it'll go like this. One, two, three, four. So that's three, low one, three, low two, E, high two, and then three, three. And there you have the entire A part. Let's go back to the beginning. We're gonna just play the A part all the way through nice and slow and see how it goes. Starting with that open D, one, two, three, four. We now have half the tune under our fingers. Let's go ahead and ooh, let's go ahead and try the B part. The first phrase of the B part starts with a pickup note. It starts with your open E and it's gonna go like this. One, two, three, four. So that's E, low one, low two, three, three. Low one, low two, three, three, low two, one. I'm putting a little fourth finger grace note in there because I can't help myself. The next phrase of the B part starts with your open E and it'll go like this. This is kind of a fun phrase. It's also a little bit annoying, but it's fun. One, two, three, four. So that's E, low two, low two, E, low two, low two, E, low one, low two, low two, low one, E. Whew. The next phrase starts with your low first finger on the E string and it'll go like this. One, two, three, four. That's low one, low two, three, three, low two, low one, E, low one, low two, low two, one, low one, E. And the last phrase starts with your third finger on the E string and it'll go like this. One, two, three, four. So that's three, low one, three, low two, E, high two, three, three. So that is the whole B part, which means we've gotten through the second half of the tune. So let's try that whole half. Starting with your pickup note on the open E, one, two, three. Nice job, everyone. We have made it. We have learned the whole tune. We're amazing. Let's go ahead and play the whole thing with the metronome. I'm gonna set it to 80. One, two, one, two, three, four.
love this tune. If you'd like to try playing that melody all the way through up to speed, you can go back to the beginning of the video and play it along with me. All right, now that we have the basic tune, it sounds great on its own. We don't really have to do anything to it, but we could. So let's learn a variation, and I'm just going to teach you a couple of little things that are gonna add a little pizzazz. We're gonna be focusing today on a few melodic variations. Let's start with the A part. So we're gonna play the beginning completely normally, nothing to see here. And then right here we're gonna change things up. So just changing that descending part a little bit, we're gonna go and then we're replacing the next phrase with a slightly different phrase. We're gonna go instead of so it goes three low two a three one three let's go ahead and play that whole a part just incorporating that one melodic variation one two three four Now that we're into the B part, we're gonna do one of my favorite things. It's just a good trick to have up your sleeve. The whole first time through the B part will be a variation. So this is what it's gonna sound like. One, two, three, four. something that is one of my favorite things to do and if you've been watching my videos you might have seen me do it many a time before. We're gonna be playing the B part, a lot of the B part, down an octave which means we're taking the melody which would normally start on your E up there and we're gonna move it down to start on the E down here. So it'll go like this. One low two three A A then low two Then here's a the little fancy part. One, three, three, one, three, three. Then one, low, two, three, three, low, two, one, low, two, three, A. And then this is where the melody sort of changes so that we can work our way back up the octave. We're gonna go A, three, A, and then high two. E, E, low one, low two, and then this is gonna sound familiar. So we're playing down the octave. Working our way back up with a little melodic change. And then we're back to the normal melody for the end. And then we can just play the B part through normally. All right, so let's try playing the whole B part variation, starting with the fancy one, and then we're gonna end up just playing one more time through the B part completely normal. Here we go. One, two, three, four. <laughs> playing that variation up to speed, you can go back to the beginning of the video and play it along with me. All right, fiddlers, that wraps up this month's video. I really appreciate you being along for the ride, the boat ride this time around. If you'd like sheet music and practice tracks for today's tune, there's a link in the description for that. Thanks guys, happy fiddling, and I will see you soon.